What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to reinstall the keyboard driver on your Windows PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial. For more information, click on the first link in the description below. Sometimes your keyboard may stop responding correctly or completely due to outdated or corrupted drivers. Reinstalling them can often resolve these issues. Before we start, it's a good idea to schedule a system shutdown. This is just a precaution in case you face navigation issues during the process. Open Command Prompt as an administrator by searching for CMD in Windows Search, right-clicking on it and choosing Run as Administrator. Type Shutdown S T 600 to schedule a shutdown in 10 minutes. This gives us enough time to uninstall the driver without interruptions. Press the Windows key and X and select Device Manager to open the interface where we can change hardware components. Alternatively, search for Device Manager in your Start menu search to open it up. In the Device Manager, expand the Keyboard section. Right-click on your keyboard listed and select Uninstall Device. Follow any confirmation prompts. If you have multiple keyboard drivers listed, repeat this process for each one. After uninstalling the driver, wait for your PC to shut down as per the scheduled time. When you turn your PC back on, Windows will automatically detect the keyboard and reinstall the necessary drivers. Ensure your PC is connected to the Internet during this process, as Windows may need to download the latest drivers. If your keyboard is still not working after this process, you may want to check if it's a hardware issue. These steps and more information will be available in my extensive guide linked in the description below. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.